Welcome back to the latest anime news for the week ending March 9th, 2018. Lots of new anime announcements this week. In fact, it's pretty much all new anime announcements. So let's go ahead and get to it. Um, see here. Um, uh, Kino Kunihiko Ikuhara, legendary director of Sailor Moon, Revolutionary Girl Utena, and everyone's favorite lesbian bear storm, is back with a new anime coming out next year. We don't know much. Its title is Sarazan Mai, and animation studios Mappa and Lapin Track will work on it. Mappa also worked on Yuri on Ice and In This Corner of the World, while Lapin Track worked on Ikuhara's prior work, the previously mentioned Yurikuma Arashi or Lesbian Bear Storm. Um, other than that, we will find out as time goes on. Uh, equally legendary anime director Mamoru Oshii, famous for directing the first two Ghost in the Shell films, the Pet Labor films, and others, has signed on to direct an anime film of the Chimera or Chimera novels. That's a 16-volume series of novels that ran from 1982 to 2002 in Japan. The story apparently focuses on, on, a, focuses on a normal high school student who keeps dreaming about an insect eating him from the inside out. Ew. He then encounters an elite student who, well, presumably they either fight or become best buddies against some cosmic threat. Or both. Uh, no news on a release date for that, but it's presumably years away, right? Um, uh, don't know much beyond that. Uh, let's see here. Um, speaking of long wait times, Fuji TV announced an anime series coming out next January called Revisions. It has a very serious looking trailer, looking like it's aiming at a more mature audience. How mature? It'll be directed by Goro kan Kanaguchi of Planet Tess. And it's being co-written by Makoto Fukami of Psychopass and Taichi Hashimoto of Speedgrapher. So definitely a more serious pedigree out of that one. Let's see here. Uh, not nearly as serious, but closer to my own heart. That time I got reincarnated as a slime. Started life as a novel uh, released directly to the net, um, which quickly exploded and now has over 400 million page views. This is the manga, actually. Later adapted into a manga, which you can buy, and you guessed it, it's getting an anime series. Uh, Yasuhito Kikuchi of Infinite Stratos and Macross Frontier will direct, with Kazuyuki Furiyasu of Recovery of an MMO Junkie and Girls Last Tour writing. And I just had to mention that the monsters will be designed by Takehiro Kishida, who has a wonderfully eclectic resume. He did character designers on Serial Experiments Lane, directed the chibi ending credit sequence se uh, for the original Tenchi Moyo OVA and the cool opening for the original Oh My Goddess OVA, did key animation on everything from Gunbuster to Infinite Stratos to Hibane Renmei to Ghost in the Shell Standalone Complex, then just designed the characters in Puella Magi Minoka Magica. So, yeah, why not? Let's just do all that stuff. But we're not done with the new anime announcements yet. Tokyo MX announced a series premiering only a month away on April 9th. Um, and I do not have the uh, lower thirds for this. Lady Spo, short for Lady Sports, will be a science fiction comedy about pro sports bounty hunter girls. Let that sink in. It'll focus on three girls who apparently participate in various sports challenges. Looks cute, though. Uh, the director's been in anime for a while, mostly as an episode director on shows like Fairy Tale. All right, uh, so yeah, let, let's get this working. And we're still not done, as if pro sports bounty hunter girls weren't weird enough. Uh, Fuji TV announced a new anime series starting uh, coming in October. Ready for this? It's an anime adaptation of Ingress, the Android augmented reality app. If you're not familiar, it's the technology that Pokemon Go was based off of. You visit real-world places and claim them for one of two sides in an underground war using your phone. So we're going to get an anime version of that. It actually sounds like it would work pretty well as an anime, but uh, kind of odd that they're uh, working on that. Anyway, let's finish off with a fun little tease. Um, it's not unreasonable to pay attention to Masashi Kishimoto. He created Naruto, after all. After finishing up the Naruto manga, he started working on a science fiction story for Shonen Jump. The big question was this, would it be a standalone work or a long running work? Well, Jump's editor-in-chief confirmed today, or this week, that this will be a serialized story, not a one-shot. So yes, Kishimoto's new work will be science fiction, and it will almost certainly see an anime adaptation one day. 
Will it be Kid Ninjas in Space? Probably not, but actually that'd be pretty cool, right? Yeah. Okay, that's all the anime news that I can fit into this video. Uh, thank you for watching, and I will see you next week.